Hey Leo, how are you today? I'm good, I'm good. <laughs> okay, so today we try to improve your breaststroke, okay? okay? So I've never seen you swim on breaststroke, it's the first time I'm gonna see your skill. Uh, and then we try to do some correction from there. So okay. you have been teaching breaststroke last time? Um, I learned it as well when I was a kid, so I've never had any other lessons other than when I was young. Okay, Yeah. maybe you show me first how you swim your breaststroke and then we can start from there, okay? Cool. Uh, let's go. Excellent. Okay, not too bad. You have um, a default on your breaststroke, which is very, very common. A lot of people, they have this problem. Is when you kick, in the same time you open your hands to take a breath. And actually the idea of the breaststroke is the opposite. When you kick, you need to stretch your arms to glide forward, not pulling the water with your hands to breathe up. Okay. So basically when you kick, you want to be horizontal inside the water. Okay? okay? So you kick and stretch, after stretch, then you will pull. Don't kick and pull. Kick and stretch. And then pull after the stretch. Okay, let me try. Sure. Better. Right. That's better. So when you kick, your hands go forward. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's a good thing. Now when you kick, put your head inside the water so you can blow bubbles looking at the ground. Okay, kick and stretch, kick and stretch, not too bad. Okay, you still have the idea of kicking and opening too fast. Now, I would like you to kick, keep your hands forward for maybe one second and a half or two seconds. Don't, don't use your hands. Kick, glide on the surface for maybe two seconds. Okay. Okay? Your head below your arms. Better. Kick and stretch. Yes, that's correct. Yes. Yes. Okay. Do you feel the difference? I glide. Yes. So the idea of breaststroke is gliding, okay? It's not like doing many movements and getting tired. Yeah. And your head is very important. When you breathe, you look up. Mm -hmm. When you kick, you are underwater with your head and you glide. So your head goes, lift up your hands. In the sky, show me. Okay, both together, head down, head down. Okay, you are like this. Uh -huh. So basically, when you kick, you become like this in this position. You glide with your hands, okay? Your head is below the water, under your arms. That's the position. Then you breathe, your head will go up, that's no problem. Then you can pull with your hands, all right? We try one more time. I want you to kick and stretch with your hands under your arms, blowing bubbles. And I, so I don't put my head in, I just, Yes, you put your head in. Okay. You blow bubbles. When you kick, I don't want to see your head. Okay. Okay, that's definitely better. Now, another mistake you do, mm -hmm. you pull all the way and you go up with your head after the pull. Nope. You need to go up when you pull. So you don't move your hand first and then move your head. You move your head when you pull. So basically it's like you kick, you glide. After the glide, you look up with your head and you pull in the same time. You don't pull and then look up after the pull. That's what you do now. So I pull and look up at the same time? Yes, you don't pull first and look up after. Okay. Because right now you pull first and then you look up after. Okay. All right, let's try to go this way. So kick and glide, look up and pull. Look up with your head, a bit better. Okay. Kick and glide with your head down, pull. Kick and glide, pull. Yep. Yep. Okay, stop. Much better. So you don't pull and then look up, you look up and you pull, kick and glide. Look up and pull, kick and glide, all right? And blow bubbles when you kick. You remember the kick is strong, huh? The power comes from the legs on breaststroke. Okay. Let me go.
much better when you keep remember to look down and glide as long as possible. Okay. How you feel? Good. <laughs> it's good. I, I, I forgot about the sensation of gliding in the water, so it's great. Thanks. Okay, so you see, you don't need much correction actually. You just need to understand what is the idea, what posture you need to adopt, and uh, what sensation you need to feel, right? So when you feel the glide, then you're right. When you pull and breathe, and then kick, and then to glide, then you're good, okay? Right? <laughs> All right, bye-bye, see you next time. <laughs>